Hello, I'm Tu Tran, and I'm here as a judge at the Jello Mold competition here at the Galana Studio Suite. This event is um, a competition for people working in Jello and various forms of gelatin and things that jiggle and their innovative use of mold. What I wanted to do was create a uh, hollow ball of jello, like using rotational molding. And as this rotates around, it spins this internal frame. It coats it, coats it, coats it. This, this ball is actually filled with air. Uh, you could fill it with alcohol or you could fill it with cream. Yeah, that's pistachio jello, and we flavored it with almond. And we did jello joy. Jello joy. We started by carving the positive forms, and then from there, we vacuum formed and we made these molds. We had a friend over last night. She stayed till five o'clock in the morning, to help us. Rolling, rolling beads. Little beads. She rolled like hundreds of beads. Them, for us and then we had to beat them all. I'm eating a boob. I'm eating a Jello boob. She told me that all the ingredients are hand squeezed, um, uh, and um, so the nipples made out of watermelon. Hand squeezed watermelon juice, and then the the breast is made with peach. And then the, the inside is made with uh, Lapsang Sushong uh, smoky milk. This pie one was amazing. It tastes really good. So there's like all these like really like delicate pie flavors that are really, really good. And then like the caviar one is like really executed very well. So it's a pretty thorough idea. Um, so we were kind of thinking we would use the poor man's material to make the rich man's food. And seeing as caviar has such translucency, it kind of made sense. To create the caviar taste, we added in salt and then actually like the store-bought caviar paste. And we made jiggly wrap. The flavor is relevant to what they are. Like this is supposed to taste like chicken. This is more of a compliment to the egg. The taste is kind of salty. Whereas here with the peppers, the seasoning that went to it was very spicy. It's like the um, packaging starts to like grab the flavor from the actual object it's containing. What actually like, excites me the most about Jello is that it's just it's such a weird, um, like kinetic food. It, it, it's, it's squishy. It's cool. You can do lots of things with it. It's a really really fun food.